were just talking about those high waves on the beaches. The town of Southampton has declared a state of emergency that will stay in effect until Monday. And we are already seeing high winds and surf across our area. Eyewitness News reporter Tom Negevin continues our team coverage from Jones Beach. A sand berm built up to protect the beach has been overwhelmed. The ocean pouring inland, coastal flooding already an issue, and Lee hasn't even arrived. There was dunes. They had the sand piles up uh, yesterday, and as you can see, the power of Mother Nature just, uh, just wiped it right off. Red flags and pounding surf. Onlookers abound across Long Island, here to witness nature's power safely from the beach. It's something to see. Not everybody has a chance to see the ocean in this state. Stay out of the water and just look at it from a distance. Newscopter 7 over the Rockaways yesterday. Surfers enjoying conditions while they still could. It's far too dangerous to try this anywhere in the New York City area today. Lifeguards on patrol this morning emphasizing the danger of getting near the ocean in conditions like this. It can be uh, extremely dangerous for even the best swimmer, um, even the best surfers. It's just not advised. It's not worth the risk. If somebody gets in trouble, even in, in the shore break or a minor rip, they're going to get sucked right out so fast that um, we're not going to be able to get to them fast enough. Even this late in the season, lifeguards will be out over the weekend. Their mission to keep people out of the water. The state deploying about 50 members of the National Guard to Long Island to help.